Where, madam, do you get your facts? It is in your journal, sir. It is all in your journal. Some would have you to believe today that all of this is the work of chance and not that of divine providence. Good morning, Major Washington. His lordship said that you are to insist that the governor send you with a letter addressing Mr. Christopher Guest. They butchered him in front of his wife and children so that no provincial nor Indian, not loyal to the French, would dare venture to go where you and the governor would have us go. Many in the house believe your trip to the French commandant to be theatrics, to induce public sentiment both here and abroad for war. How, George, do you respond to this indictment that some would say to be unreasonable reasoning in the age of reason, sir? Be of any consequence if the boy dies in the wilderness. He led us into Ottawa territory. That Indian will find his brothers and they will hunt us down. He eats and you think like a boy. What is your name, madam? To you, my dear. I am simply Sally. Say your goodbyes, Major. Said nay, Mr. Giss. We are not only emissaries of the Crown, but ambassadors of the Divine. We shall cross, and without delay. 